Hello everybody and welcome to an epoch tutorial video for a dedicated server hosted by the Game and Junkie. Hello everybody, in this tutorial video I'm going to show you how to set up the admin menu that's already that already comes with the epoch. Alright, what you want to do is go to your epoch server then click on epoch hive And then click on Epoch AH. And then what you want to do is scroll down until you get to where it says Admin Owner. And then what you want to do is get your Steam ID, which is the ID that Steam gives you. And the best way to find that out is open up Armor 3, the game. Then go to profile. Then go to profile. Well, you used to be able to see it right here. Yeah, it used to be right here, so I don't know what happened to it. Okay, well, I don't know where to lo locate it at now. But it used to be right here where you can look at it and everything, but I guess they changed it. Well, another way is just to Google it. And just pretty much Google and most places tell you exactly how to do it. See main menu config profile. That's what I thought too. Yeah, see other people thinking the same thing I am. Well, I honestly don't know how to do it now. So anyway, you put in your Steam ID here and then the name of the player. And then you save the file and you start up your server. I don't need that open. Need that open. I'll wait until my game starts, then I'll close that. Hey, I'm gonna pause the video while this is doing it. Alright, people, I figured out how to look for your Steam ID. 
you open up your Steam, click on, uh, well, first thing, you want to make sure you go into settings, go to interface, and make sure you have this checked, or uh, display Steam URL address bar. And then go into community, I mean, go into your profile and view friends. And then your Steam ID is right there in the address bar. Just copy that and then hang on. Paste it into there. And that's pretty much it. Then start your game. Waiting, waiting, waiting. So this is my test server. Password is test. And in my last video, I showed you how to change out your load screen. Just uh, if, if you're YouTube channel, it's in there. I'll show you what it looks like. There it is right there. The Game and Junkie Show Epoch server hosted by the Game and Junkie. Now yeah, just waiting for it to load up. Sure does take a while to load up, doesn't it? Wow, what happened? There it goes. Got to show you that the thing works. I'll just let the game catch up first. Hit F1. I'm gonna teleport somewhere. I was kicked. I wonder why I was kicked. I guess that's what I get for doing stuff offline while I'm waiting on the server.
I gotta remember how to teleport. There we go. Forgot to say, not my Epoch server. I mean, my Exile server. I have a little shack here and everything. But as you can tell, everything works so far. Spawn in some loot. Okay, now I'm going to add a suit. And let's add a weapon. I like M16s. But I can't remember what ammo it is. <laughs> I can never remember what ammo it is. I got the best. I don't think there's nothing I can get. There, now I got all my weapons, all my gear. I can't see crap. I'm not sure what my M16 takes. Oh, they need energy. Oh, lordy, lordy, lordy. Well, as you can tell, it works, so... How do I give myself energy? Well, let's give ourselves God mode. <laughs> All right, I guess on this server my base is going to be over there. 
Screw this running crap. Glad I wasn't close to the water. I haven't played Epoch in a while, as you can tell. Mama's gonna be mad at me. I gotta figure out why it's lagging. Oh, I know why. I got five things going on in the background. But as you can tell, that's, everything's working good. Admin tool works really good. Alright, well, uh, subscribe, uh, give me a thumbs up, and I do take requests. Y'all have a good one.